Good morning. It's Tuesday, May 28th, and you're watching Eagle Eye News. I'm Berlin. I'm Addison. Here's, Here's today's, today's announcement. announcement. Attention all students enrolled in AP English Literature for next year. There will be a very brief meeting on Wednesday, May 29th, at 2.50 in Ms. Conrad's room, 226. If you cannot make it, please stop by any time the next day for important materials and such. The Hudson Valley Equestrian Team gives students the opportunity to ride and show horses to the Michigan Interscholastic Horsemanship Association. We are a competitive team that competes against other schools in District 16. We have a high school team, which is for students grades 9 through 12. In order to ride for the equestrian team, you must either own or lease a horse. Horses are not provided. A student who does not have a horse may still participate as a groom. Riders of all experience levels are welcome. To receive information regarding the team, please contact Coach Linda Luck at the email on the screen. You have a few days left to cash in May's Business of the Month, DJ's Pizza. Any Gold Renaissance students can stop in for a free slice of pizza with a purchase of a fountain pop with their BOM card and student ID. Your free slice is only available, though, through 3.30, Monday through Saturday. Exam reviews begin Thursday, May 30th. There is no sign-up required. Just stop in. All sessions are ran by a certified teacher of that subject area. Tonight is senior night for varsity baseball. It's also Ryan Aaron's bobblehead night. Game time is 4.30 versus South Christian. Time for tech tip number nine, courtesy of Mr. Matthew Seconar. Today on Tech Tips, we will show you how to access your documents offline. Open Google Docs and find all of your documents. Click the three dots by one of your docs, and you will see a slider that says Available Offline. Click the slider to make the document available offline. This also works with Google Sheets and Google Slides. Accessing your documents offline can be really helpful, especially when you're in a location with limited or no internet connection. With this feature, you can continue working on your files without worrying about internet access. So next time you know you'll be in an area with spotty Wi-Fi or no connection at all, make sure to mark your important documents, presentations, and spreadsheets as available offline. This way, you can stay productive and keep working on your projects, no matter where you are. We continue celebrating our retiring teachers. Up next is Mrs. Bennett. Hi, my name is Mrs. Bennett, and I am retiring this year after teaching for a little over 30 years. I've been in Hudsonville for 23 years, and I started my career at Forest Hills Northern High School, and I also taught at Forest Hills Central High School a little bit. Over the course of that time, I have taught foods and nutrition, advanced foods, child development, early childhood education, health and phys ed. I've taught kindergarten and pre-K for six years at Forest Grove, Allward, and Jamestown Elementaries here in Hudsonville. And I have also taught housing and interiors, family health, quite a, quite a list of things. After I retire, I am hoping to uh, work when I want to and not when I work when I don't want to. Uh, you might see my face around here subbing a little bit. And I, um, my hope is to offer some adult culinary classes. What being a teacher has meant to me is uh, being able to be impactful with kids and to be able to build relationships with them. And of course, I'm passionate about what I teach. And so the things that I've been able to teach kids over the course of my life, I feel are going to be very impactful for their lives, their skills that they're going to definitely be able to use. I am looking forward to, in retirement also, going to the bathroom whenever I want to. That's one thing that I'm really looking forward to. Um, and I would say that uh, the thing that I would want to leave kids with here is I have told kids for years and years that if you don't want to go to college, that's okay. And sometimes it just takes kids think a little bit of time to figure things out do what you love because working for 30 or 40 years, you want to make sure that you're doing something that you absolutely love. So uh, I leave Hudsonville uh, giving my best to everyone here, 
and um, to just tell you all to keep following your dreams and keep pursuing the things that you love to do. Congrats to Mrs. Bennett. We wish you the best. Tune in tomorrow to hear from Mr. Key. As for tomorrow's Eagle Eye News, Mr. V's fourth hour, you're back on the clock. Are you a student on the Renaissance Blue or Gold list? If so, we invite you to an ice cream social to celebrate you doing great things this year. On Wednesday, freshmen can stop by the ice cream social table at the North Campus Cafeteria during both lunches. Sophomores in Renaissance can get their ice cream on Thursday, May 30th in the South Campus Cafeteria, and juniors will be served on Friday, May 31st in the South Campus Cafeteria. Here are the birthdays for today, May 28th. Are you hungry? Yeah, are you? Yeah, I'm pretty hungry. Let's go down to snacking with Slim for the lunch. Be sure to bring your school ID with your Renaissance sticker on the back. Welcome to Snacking with Slim. Today's special is three cheese pasta with garlic toast and green beans. Today's hot sandwich is mini corn dogs, and the pizza is a pepperoni calzone. Three cheese pasta, it's okay, I'll give it a two. Uh, the hot sandwich, mini corn dogs. Corn dogs are not a sandwich. I'm gonna give that a one. And the pepperoni calzone, that's pretty good. I'll give it a four. Thanks for watching, Eagles. What's your favorite words? Uh, I can't decide between cool and beans. I really like cool beans. <laughs> Let's go down and see what Hudsonville's favorite words are. I'm here with... Mr. Meerman. And what's your word of the day? Character. Why? Because you need to do what's right, even when nobody's looking. Mr. Signori. And what's your word of the day? Andiamo. It's Italian for let's go! I'm here with... Riley Tuttle. Chad. And what's your guys' word of the day? Win, because we have regionals this weekend. <laughs> Steez, because if you're on the slope looking steezy... Do you have any hot takes? Not really, do you? Yeah, I have one. I think that more people should sleep with their socks on. But let's see what Hudsonville has to say. Mrs. Riga, do you have any hot takes you like to share? Yes, um, Taylor Swift's new album, Tortured Poets Apartment, is actually amazing, so. I haven't listened to it to myself. I'll try, I'll test that one out. You should? Thank you. Yo, you got any hot takes? Uh, Travis Scott is better than Kanye West. Do you two have any hot takes about anything? Yeah, yeah, I think we have one. Okay, do you want to do it? Taylor Swift is overrated. And I second that, I second that. Uh, you guys got any hot takes you want to share? We think it's so not pop. Not pop. <laughs> I agree with that one. I agree. Any hot takes you feel strongly about? Um, in the finale of Young Sheldon, I think Sheldon should have stopped, should have died instead of George. How about you yeah. three? I, I, I think that's a great, great take. Yeah, it's a crazy Yeah, I also yeah. think um, Playboy Cardi is a very overrated rapper. That's, that's fair, that's fair. Hey, you guys got any hot takes? It's Meyer instead of Myers, 100%. I feel that. That's, that's how, true, that's that's how the grocery that's store true. said. It's Meyer. Who said Meyer? Thanks for joining us today and thanks for watching. Have a great Tuesday, Eagles.